great hunters of that time were falconeers. And uh, these uh, two portrayals of the dogs, they actually should be hawks or falcons that are hunting with the with Orion. They are his companions. He had two hawks that was hunting with him rather than two dogs hunting rabbits. These are two hawks hunting serpents. And this makes the whole message of Gemini come into focus because both Canis Major, which has the star Cyrus in it, and Canis Minor, which has the star uh, uh, Procyon in it, both show a vindication and an attack of evil uh, against the enemy. So I thought that was really interesting. Also, it's given that um, there's two dogs. Um, again, that made me think of maybe the two witnesses, but then also the pairs of the 144,000 helping to, you know, attack evil. And so that was really cool. Um, sign of Jonah, maybe that's all the evil that's being unleashed by the enemy. Um, and then I, the other dream I wanted to cover is, um, I forget when exactly I had this, maybe one, like two months ago. Uh, I was a little girl and I was on a big ship with other people, other girls, and there weren't too many of us, and um, so I was thinking, oh, great, um, you know, is that pointing to Argo the ship? That's another constellation. Um, it's a very last decan in Cancer, so it would fall at the end, so that was interesting. Uh, so then this is the last uh piece that I have here um, on the day of the winter uh, summer solstice six, June 21st I woke up at 2 22 in the morning and I heard a kind of like a big loud bell ding song sound so it made me think of a clock and um, so I was like okay that's interesting like we just hit you know here if you put this um, Enoch's calendar in the form of a clock, which Diana was kind of led to um, as well. Um, then, you know, we just hit three o'clock. Uh, God's Gift also has a video where she was given 3.30, 4.40, and then I think she was also given the word clock. Um, so if we look at what's 3.30, you know, when the long hand reaches over here, the short hand's going to be here. That's leading us to the middle of Gemini, which is early July. And that's where we get this, uh, the, the Canis Major, which is the, the one that has the star, the brightest star in the sky. Um, the prince is coming. And that's, you know, uh, when I saw that whale dog, that was, I was on a date, so I take that as an appointed time, so I'm on high watch for this time frame here, and also, um, uh, 440, if you put 440, you know, would be past the midpoint here, for 430, so 440 would be over here, that would be the last, um, Deccan, which would be the ship, so is like all the action going to happen from that time? It's possible. I mean, we're already here. So, you know, to get to the middle part here when we see this guy is very, very soon. It's just a matter of days. So I'm extremely excited about that. Another confirmation about this is when I was on vacation just uh, last month, I booked nothing. My husband booked everything. And we ended up staying at the Wagner Hotel. Well, guess who... Which composer composed the wedding march? Da -da -da -da, da -da 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 that one. Um, it was Wagner. Um, we stayed in room 320. That was assigned to us. And the artwork was of um, these two shepherd ladies. So it looked kind of like that. It was uh, two young girls and lots of little shepherds. I thought that was really cute. Um, so very exciting times. I just wanted to put out there because I know a lot of people are discouraged. Don't be a doubting Thomas. I think it's funny that we're, um, 
we just passed uh, Taurus, which was uh, the sign of Doubting Thomas, you know, um, which kind of happened after Pentecost. So let's continue. We just have a little bit while to go, I think. Um, all right, that's all. Thank you.